Welcome to a tour of some of Ireland's most famous heritage sites, compiled by the Archaeological Institute of America. We begin by visiting Dublin Castle, built in AD 1204 on the site of a Viking settlement. The castle has been used as a military fortress, a prison, a law court, and was the seat of English administration in Ireland for 700 years. Kilkenny Castle, a symbol of Norman occupation, would have formed the central part of a walled town when it was built in 1195 by the first Earl of Pembroke. Renovated in the Victorian period, this castle is famous as the seat of the Marquesses and Dukes of Ormond. Navan Fort is a legendary power center of pre-Christian Ireland, featured prominently in Irish mythology and most likely a pagan ritual site. Now on to Dunmore Cave, the site of an infamous Viking massacre in 928. The largest Anglo-Norman castle in Ireland, Trim Castle, was begun in 1176 on the site of an earlier wooden fortress. Tara was the reputed seat of the High Kings of Ireland. The site was the center of activity going back to the 4th millennium BC. Noeth is the largest of 18 Neolithic tombs in this area that contains more than a third of all known megalithic art in Western Europe. Discovered in the boglands of North Mayo, Cajun Fields is a 6,000-year-old field system comprised of agricultural fields surrounded by stone walls. Situated on the east shore of Strangford Lock, Mount Stuart was the home of the Marquesses of Londonderry and includes the Temple of the Winds. Farmley was built by Edward Cecil Guinness in the 1880s and is representative of the Edwardian period when wealthy industrialists moved to the forefront of Irish elite society. Once the westernmost settlement in Ireland, the Blasket Islands were abandoned in 1953 when the population dropped and conditions became too dangerous. A monastic settlement located on Mahi Island in Strangford Lock. Nendrim was in service for over six centuries. Struel Wells is an early Christian site dating from before the time of St. Patrick. It is composed of four wells built around a stream flowing through the valley. Dating to the 15th century AD, Galrus Castle features a four-story vaulted tower with no extant battlements. Located on the larger rock-bound island of Skellig Michael, the 6th century AD monastic settlement of St. Fionan served as a safe haven for persecuted Catholics. Located on the east bank of the River Shannon, the Clonmacnoise Monastic Settlement was founded in the mid-6th century. Located on a basalt outcrop overlooking the sea, Dunluce Castle was first constructed on the site in the 14th century AD. On the northern shore of Belfast Lock, Carrickfergus Castle is a Norman-style castle built in 1177 as the military headquarters for John de Courcy. Donegal Castle was built in the 15th century by the O'Connell Chieftain out of local limestone and sandstone. Situated near Loch Derg and the River Shannon, Portumna Castle was the seat of the de Burgo family from 1618 to 1826. The traditional seat of the Kings of Munster, 
The Rock of Cashel is a group of medieval buildings built on a limestone outcrop in the Golden Vale. Now you can explore the rest of these amazing Irish heritage sites on your own using Google Earth today.